Pro Day, an in-person job interview for the National Football League that can take you from being just another guy to seeing your name scroll across the bottom of the screen during the NFL draft. And for HBCU football prospects, sometimes all it takes is impressing the right scout on the right team to punch your ticket to the league. And for a handful of the Celebration Bowl champion Bulldogs from South Carolina State, a good showing at their pro day could add their name to a long list of NFL players to come out of Orangeburg. Good to see you out here supporting the guy. Oh man, got to, got to, man. And in the University of South Carolina State of the Art practice facility, it was time for some of HBCU football's best to see how they measure up in the eyes of the pro scout. And this is the NFL, so you know it was business first. And once the paperwork was signed, the process of exact measurement began. All the way out. 32 and 7 eighths. 509 Durant? Yeah, Durant. Durant, 183, 183. Jacoby Durant, one of four HBCU prospects at this year's NFL Combine, was fresh off running a 4-4-1 in Indianapolis, and came into his pro day looking to keep impressing with the measurement. 36 best! Durant, 36 best. Yeah, good job. Good. Nine, nine best. Kobe, good job, buddy. Go. Here Tyson Gray, the 6'4", 300-pound offensive lineman from Columbia was back in his hometown and looking to put on for his city in the league. Cornerback Zaire Kelly, right on to Kobe Durant's heels on the broad jump and the vertical. Tackle machine Chad Gilchrist showed that he's also got some explosiveness to go with that good NFL linebacker side. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. Will Vereen, the versatile Bulldog receiver showcased not only his strength, but that the word quit ain't in his vocabulary. And once the measured portion of Pro Day was over, we made our way to the indoor facility for speed and agility drills. Jacoby Durant, clean around the corner in his three cone drill. Will Vereen, 200 pounds of movement floating out the break in his 40th attempt. <laughs> Chad Gilker, looking fluid, changing direction in and out of cuts during his agility drill. And while Zaire Kelly's speed is a given, watching him and Dakobe Durant not miss a beat during DB position drills was a thing of beauty.
And after being this close to an NFL job interview, it's easy to see how a prospect can make a name for themselves in an atmosphere like Pro Day. And with exposure being the most tossed around reason for the lack of HBCU football players in the NFL draft, Pro Day feels like the only moment where HBCU prospects get to speak directly to the NFL and the league's own language, and possibly turn an afternoon of measurables, drills, and workouts into the opportunity of a lifetime.